hello guys this is the first review or the first video of review that i'm going to make for the android nugget update on the Lenovo z2 plus and as you can see um, in the ui bar nothing much has changed we are still having the google default home launcher then uh, okay let me first show you the features that we are getting in the android nugget update first i'll show you the version that we are on we are running on android 7.0 although we have 7.1 and 7.4 which have already been released for nexus and all the mobiles we have received this update on 26th april 2017 the zui version is 2.5.104 st and all the things look same the setting menu nothing has changed as such we have one new feature known as lab features where i think they are still experimenting with the things now we have a split screen which is given here you have to enable it it is disabled by default then we have screen record which i'm using as of now then um, in the quick panel you have a few new entries like the split screen and the screen record and the all button once you click on all this whole quick panel menu will be open then then the thing which i like a lot was display everything looks same um, if you go here and you are planning to change the wallpaper let's say you selected some decent one this and when you go on select you have these three menus you can either set it on home screen lock screen or home let's say lock screen is the right one which i have to receive this so now my home screen is changed yes I show you my lock screen. This is my lock screen, which is still having the previous wallpaper, which was there. Then, one mm, this they've introduced this volume changer, and it, this is translucent now. Previously, it was opaque, and this looks very good actually. Makes it a power. Then, let's check something else. This is all my friends. This is all but a change. Now, few things which haven't changed, like the notification bar, it is dead at always. You don't have that multiple reply, then uh, coming up all the responses or all the messages, all those things you won't have here. Quick panel is like that only. Then, uh, many of you, are, I'm not sure, it means most of us Z2 users, we use this U touch only, but few of us are still using the default Android the buttons like back button home button and the recent button but those are now removed previously they were under u touch you have the option to enable disable the home screen button but now they have uh, removed now you have to get accustomed with this zui button the u touch rest all is same there nothing change as such uh, the I haven't seen any lags although I was having some issues in starting my play store the amp was crashing so I had to restart my phone multiple times and now it's working fine apart from that there were no issues lags or something although the update was of almost 1 GB but there is not much noticeable difference here the UI is same notification bar is same and the split screen is introduced and screen recorder now let me show you how to use a split screen so I don't want to open my WhatsApp. So okay, Play Store is it? I don't want to make it split. I'll just go here. Okay, I think I did it fast. This is the Play Store. Now you go over the quick panel, select your split screen. Voila! Now you have a split screen. Now all the other apps that you have shown here you can select any one of them like I did for YouTube now I can write anything <coughs> and I have so this is what we have in this split screen here. you can switch it if I drag it up YouTube will become a primary app plug it down this will become a primary app 
this is the split screen that we have screen recorder is the one which I am using right now to make this video so if you find anything that I haven't missed or some feature which are there which are which have to be enabled disabled or going to the developer menu something like that to be done just do let me know and to like this video subscribe for the channel we'll be coming up with more videos as soon as possible we'll be doing a full depth in the in-depth review also let's see how that goes thank you so much guys have fun have a great day